The new zoo is getting ready for a fun family event. Neil Anderson joins us live from Swamico with all the details. Hi, Neil. Hey, good morning. Well, we just want to show you a quick, you know, we talked earlier about those the little snow monkeys yeah. getting used to being outside with the other ones. You can see there's a little one sitting at the end of the chute. <laughs> and he's having a little temper tantrum right now because he wants somebody to pick him up. Oh, my. And actually, well, you know, and, he, and here's the bad part about that. I mean, see, you can see coming down over here, there's um, a little one with uh, the other little one. And that is that little one is actually with his mom. And he's not real happy about that right now. Oh. So, but you know, it's interesting how the you know how uh, they kind of worked himself uh, into the troop, and you know that's something that we've had some experience here, uh, getting hand raised uh, infants like this back into the troop, and uh, seems to be going pretty good. So, uh, that's a great thing, and you can see the little one running around. Oh, well, that one just went back in, but you know we're getting ready now for Zubu. So the, this is a real busy time of year for us. You know, we have uh, our North Shore Bank uh, Zubu coming up, and that starts really October 14th, 15th, the 21st, 22nd, 28th, and 29th. But I'll tell you one thing we do need is volunteers. It's such a, a great event for us, and, and such a big fundraiser for our operational budget as well. But if you're interested, uh, get a hold of the zoo because you know we we can use people with treat stations, candy runners, out on the haunted hayride, uh, activity stations, the food tent. We just have so many things that uh, are available for you to go have fun and, and work the event and help us out. But one of the other things we do have coming up is um, uh, pumpkin carving. And this is our second annual public pumpkin carving. And what we do there is uh, it's open to the entire public. You can come on out to the zoo. That's going to be October 12th. And that goes from 5 to 8 p.m. So you can come out, you can go ahead and carve pumpkins, you can paint pumpkins. We'll have the pumpkins here for you. The other thing we'll have is we're going to have free pizza and soda to everyone who participates in that event. And of course, that's coming up, up October 12th. Uh, but it's, uh, we've had a lot of groups out. You know, whether you just want to come out um, and volunteer yourself, or you want a group, maybe you got a company that wants to come out and spend a few hours, uh, we can certainly use the help. And, and the other thing, children age 8 to 13, uh, they can volunteer you know, with a guardian or a supervisor as well. So it's a fun family event but it really takes a lot of time to get the zoo ready to go and if you get a chance to come out to the zoo, you'll start seeing it transform right now. It's gonna be a lot of fun this year. Yeah, Very cool. looks it, and always a big crowd, right? Yes, absolutely. You know, we'll have probably somewhere around 15,000 people that will go through within uh, those three weekends, but it's, uh, it's it, you know, and the wagon rides uh, are just, just a great time out there. He's and the just kids a little a nervous about having enough candy for himself. <laughs> <laughs> I'll tell you, we always sometimes worry about having enough candy, but we all have plenty of candy. We all have a lot of treat stations, and you know, it's just a, a fun family atmosphere, a nice safe atmosphere. And you know, how cool is it to be out in the zoo when it's dark out? Yeah. You know, and you hear the animals all day. That's a lot of fun as well, too. All right. Great, great experience. Thanks, Thanks Neil. Neil.